Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Atlas. I am the Radio Man 03, and it is awesome to have you along. We are uh, out getting uh, the things that you need. <laughs> Wood, thatch, and fiber. I know. Can you believe it? It's true. Wood, thatch, and fiber. And let me tell you, this island is not super rich, at least not in the area I'm at with wood. It, it takes a while for these trees to come back. It takes a little while. Uh, so you're picking up a lot of the scrap wood on the ground, down trees and things like that. Mm -hmm. Grand Tortugar, and I killed it. <laughs> Didn't know what it was. Had no idea what it was. Never seen it before. It, it, you know, it, it threatened me. I felt threatened. The boars definitely felt threatened. And that was it. It was over for him. That's all there was to it. Um, but uh, now I know. He's a submarine. You get inside of him. Go underwater. Well, lesson learned. Uh, apparently, some of you even try to come here as often as you can to see if he's in that location. So, apparently, I got super lucky. And he was a decent level, I think. I think. I don't know. Anyways, um, yeah. So, I've never seen one before. Now I know who, what he is. There's no way I could have tamed him. Uh, this stuff here, this 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 little sparse stuff on the ground is what I'm working on right now. I'm having to dig that stuff up just to get the wood. Now, there were gators down here last time I was down this area, so we've got to be careful of that. Uh, there were two. We killed one and then just bypassed the other. But when you spawn that, when you when you log out and log back in, at least in my single-player world, we've got a cold front coming in, um, you don't... The animals don't stay. It's different animals when you come back in. Right now, what I'm working on is three different things. I put the second deck on the schooner. I can't believe I forgot there's two. I put the second deck on the schooner. Got that taken care of already. Also, uh, I've made a cage uh, so we can get a hold of a parrot. Uh, and I'm working on a pen to get an elephant in. There's a 34 down by us along with a male 3. She is the 34. So... I'm working on getting together uh, some poles right now. Uh, let's do 10. Oh, that's almost what I need. I'm going to drop that and that. Uh, and I need to dig up some potatoes so I have something to feed it. Uh, I think the coconuts would be preferred, but we don't have coconuts. There's no there's no coconuts on this island. This is like a, a I don't know, it's an oak type of something or other. I can't remember what it's called. What is it called? It's called Equator. It doesn't It doesn't give us a specific name for it right now. It probably does in there, huh? I just don't notice it. Does it actually say? Not really, huh? The cold front has having like zero effect of me on me here at the Equator. That's pretty awesome. It's pretty awesome. Not that it ever had a, a big effect on me anyways. We'll see. Maybe Maybe I will get cold. I don't know. There's another big old elephant right here. Anyways, I'm building this trap like right next to the base because the level three was kind of hanging out down by the base. Matter of fact, he got all hung up in the boars. And I thought, oh, this is perfect. This is perfect. We'll pull him in first. We'll kill him off. And then we'll get that 34. We'll, you know, just drag her down, get her inside the pen and bam. And I'm doing the pen up right too. I'm, I'm making it relatively nice, relatively nice. Uh, let's go, can I get five more? Six. Let's grab six of those. All right, beautiful. Now, now that I have that, hello. Oh, you got some weight, baby. Weight, weight, more weight. How you doing? All right, you guys are good. You guys are good. Let's go ahead and grab Thatch out of this here. Uh, let's put these poles on her. And now the next thing I want to do is work on getting the material I need in order to make a, a, a wide gate door. Uh, because I put a gate on it because I want to be able to just open it and walk them out. Because if anything else, what I'm going to do is I'm going to mark this spot as a place where we can come and get elephants. And whenever we're here, we'll take a look for that, uh, uh once I'm ready to do it, the, the Tortugar. 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 The Grand Tortugar. He's pretty cool looking. I'll give him that. He's definitely cool looking. I think I need thatch like crazy. No, I'm, I'm okay. Let's get the wood. I need a bunch of wood for the gate. I think if I get like 500, I should be covered with the wood front. And then I need, the thatch is the other thing I need. So both of them, all of it, you, you always need it. But see like there, there, that's it. That's it. You know, the next set of trees you have to go to are, are up there. 
<laughs> and that's a ways away. Now, the fiber, not so bad. These little bushes, they're everywhere. And these guys are the jute, which is really cool. What I want to have on this island is what we've got right now, that little tiny house. We'll keep the schooner dock there, too. There's no sense in ruining it. And we'll take the schooner to the next island, okay? And we'll, we'll explore the next island. But in the meantime, what I want to do is I want to go around this island and... and uh, take advantage for what it's got and go out and get a bunch of this and we've had an elephant we can gather up two of the three woods we need to be able to do journeyman stuff and i think that would be pretty cool to have uh kind of stockpiled up uh in this area and if we had to we could just come back uh you know anchor right there grab the stuff throw it on the ship and boom we go back to wherever it is we're we've, we're calling home uh this season that's what i think anyways again i don't want to be rushed I want it to go a little smoother this time because I'm a little more familiar with the game already. I've made tons of mistakes. But you know me. You know me. Um, anyways, that's that's how I kind of want it to go this time around. Just kind of nice and easy again. I like, I like going nice and easy. I'm going to grab the wood off of these guys here. We're getting almost 200 wood off of off those big downed logs. That's not too shabby. I should probably go see if that Grand Totu Gar is in there, right? <laughs> yeah. Some of you guys were like, kind of upset that I actually did that. So I, I don't know what to tell you. I did not know what it was. Uh, that's going to give me the wood I need for that. I think so. And I think I might have the thatch too. Um, do we have any more? Well, here, let's get this. let's get this guy right here. Let's finish up the wood on this beach, and then we'll go back. By the way, you see this white rock next to me? This is salt. There is salt. So what I would like to do is take that little house we have, uh, keep part of it as just kind of a shack to live in, but then put some um, uh, storage bins in there and fill them. Not Maybe not fill them completely up, but you know, get a bunch of wood, uh, some th the thatches and stuff like that, and get it kind of put in there so we could just come back here and grab it and run back to our main place, and then we'll have it uh, already stockpiled. And I think I would be silly to leave this island without getting at least an elephant. There's, as we know, tigers too. So, I mean, this is a twofold uh, whammo. This is pretty cool. We could get a couple of really nice tames here. I've not seen bears. I've not seen any bears. No. You guys were telling me in the comments that the Freeport Islands, they tend to have at least a bear on each of those islands. We did see one on ours. It was a level four, if I'm not mistaken. So it just didn't really interest me. How's my pick doing? It's doing all right. Oh, hello. Okay, all right, that's our cow. It's just kind of running around to get to us. All right, very cool. Oh, look at this that little, little cove right here. This is pretty cool. It's probably Alligator Central, though. And they're just sitting in that water and waiting for you. That's pretty cool, too, because, man, that one, that one last episode really did catch me off guard. Big time off guard. I'm just going to walk back, kind of swing a little bit with the jute as I go. So, what else did I do? Um, I've not tamed anything new. These guys, look at this. This is, this is, what, it's, this is what it's come down to for me. That's why I want this elephant. It's going to make building things so much easier. Just so much easier. We know that, right? We know that now. It's all about these tames uh, when it comes to the building. They're extremely helpful. I would hate to see the developers do anything to uh, dummy them down. They said they want them to make them a little less important. And I thought, well, I don't know. It's, it's, I think it's fun having them, you know? So don't, don't get rid of something that's fun to have that works, you know, pretty dang well. Doug, you still there? Okay. That's what I think anyways. I like the way the game plays right now. I do, I do, I do. I love being in Atlas. Let's, uh, I'm going to keep going with the, the thatch. We can go down the other side of the island, down that beach. It's a, it's a trek, though. You, you can see I'm quite a ways away, actually, from uh, where the ship is. And you've got to grab all of it. I mean, and this is like cocoa. So if you use your pick, you're not going to get the uh, the wood as much. So there's a lot of food items on this island. Lots of food items. Let's go ahead and throw. How you doing over there for weight? Okay, you're looking a little bit heavy. Let's take that off of you. Let's put that on you. 
Uh, the rays are dying like crazy over here by where we're staying right now. So there is just like this endless uh, oil supply just constantly washing up on the beach. Watch it, turtle. I don't want to hit you. But I need that wood, buddy. Oh, what's this here? This is different looking. That's cute. It's not. It's just the way the light was hitting it. Yeah, it's this bush right here. We already checked this one. I think we found just about all the foods. We don't know what's way at the top. We don't know that. Um. Yeah, here we go. I thought I saw something. All of it. Okay, I'll meet you guys back at the... Uh, at the uh, the shack, the beach shack, and we'll uh, we'll 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 get back together there, and we'll uh, we'll get to we'll get to work. We'll get something done here today. We'll get something done. What level are you, anyways? Six. Yeah, you're too small. You're too small. It rains here a lot. I'm a little surprised at just how much it actually does rain here. Maybe I should put the ones in the corner too. Let's do it. Thinking just because it's the elephant, we wouldn't do that. But uh, if, if we get a chance to do like a tiger or something, this would work just as well for that. I need uh, one more of those. The elephants have made their way down here a ways. I'm kind of hoping they would separate again because, yeah, he was way down here, back over here by the house. And she was just kind of hanging out right through in here. And I was really hoping to just kind of get her. Oh, that might be her right there. Maybe she is by herself again. That would be good. Oh, I've got the gate too, uh, number four. Now, to open this up. No. I can never remember, right? No, okay. So it's got to be this one then. There we go. We want that to open out. Uh, let me get one more of those poles. I also have to get the uh, bolas going because I don't have the bolas and I need to dig up the potatoes too. I've got a few. I've got six, but I don't think that's going to be enough to uh, kind of tie it over an elephant uh, to begin with to tame it. Um, I could use berries, but I think the potatoes will work better. Um, I think I need this. I've got the stone in there. Stone thatch and I think it's stone thatch and fiber actually. I think that's what it is for the bolas. I can't remember now. I've only made three right now. Um, B O. Okay, now I can craft twenty of them. Okay, that's good. That should be enough for us to get a thirty-four elephant down. We do have our taming speed at two, so can grab up these. <clears throat> Excuse me. For those of you who don't know, it, I caught a cold this last weekend and. It likes to settle where it wants to settle. It's uh, just, it's not even, it's just an irritating thing, you know. That's all it is. Uh, I've just got fish burning up in there, making charcoal at the same time. Um, okay, I've got the bolas. I need the potatoes. So, uh, let's grab, uh, let's grab Tug. Come on, Tug. Let's go over here with the shovel and see if we can't dig up, I don't know, let's get maybe 20 of them. I've made an extra bow, too, just in case the bow we have breaks. It's going to take a little bit to knock her down, I think. And so I want to make sure... Uh, I don't have to, you know... We're not going for the water. We're just going for the potatoes. So we don't have to do the puzzle. There's some earthworms. More earthworms. Potatoes, please. Right, let's go... Uh, let's go back over here instead. Up here, yeah. This is look. This looks like potato land to me. There it is. Oh, there we go. If we can get this here elephant, it sure would be nice. I don't know if you have to move around. If it really matters, there's twigs. That's that's a thatch. Eh. Jute. Okay, maybe maybe you do have to move around a little bit. Where are those potatoes at again? Oh, jute. No, we don't want jute. I mean, we'll take it. What the heck? There's a potato. All right, let's try that one again. No, that's jute. There's a couple. All right, there we go. Earthworms. They must have been on the potatoes. There's another potato. Shoveling drains your stamina pretty well. Uh, and <laughs> your shovel wears down pretty quick, too. 
You don't get to do too much of this. <sighs> Where are the potatoes at, man? Let's try it right here, right next to this plant. It's a potato plant. Nope. <laughs> Maybe not. Anyways, this is the last piece of the puzzle. I think I got everything I need now. The bolas, I got arrows. I, I made over 100 arrows. We've got two bows. I think we're ready to go uh, to try to tame the elephant. There's a potato. I'll be back with more riveting potato footage. Okay. The common shovel has broken. Good for nothing, common shovel. Uh, yeah, I can't believe I forgot that there's a second deck on the schooner, but we do have one on there. We have one on there now. Uh, but I'm not been getting the planks. I thought, you know what? There's elephants right here. Get an elephant. Makes it's gonna make the wood gathering so much easier and safer. <laughs> you know, I'm on the back of an elephant going around getting the wood. That's that's just great. And then we've got it with us all the time. Really, all the time, <laughs> all the time. Um, I'm just making one more of those those poles. Right. That's all I needed was the pole. Um. So I need a little bit of wood. Oh, I. I think I need more wood. I'm just going to drop this stuff for now. We don't need that. I got the potatoes. Oh, eggs. There we go. Thank you. Drop them in there. Oh. Drop that right on the floor. Yeah. That's where we put the poop. Right on the floor. Uh, I need wood thatch and fiber for that dang thing. That pole. Did I not get what I need? Oh, there we go. Just sitting here yelling at myself. Well, what the heck were you doing out there? Just getting potatoes? Uh, wood thatch and fiber. And we need the wood items. Let's grab one of those. And I think we will be good to go. Mm -hmm. We're good to try it out here now. Let's go ahead and drop that into there. Oh, I know what I need to do. I need to fix my shovel. And repair. It's going to take a second because it's uh, completely broken. Uh, I'm working my way to the larder so that we can get the larder up and running. Okay, so we're going to need the bolas on number six. We have a bed down in case we get killed. It's it's quite likely that that could happen. This is an elephant after all. Ooh, it looks like they may have separated again. That's good. Let's see. Let's get our bow back. She is sort of a, a light tannish brown color. I love the sounds back in here, the jungle sounds. It's really cool. It's just this kind of a, a, a low bug chatter going on with some birds singing every now and again. Uh, where is she? Yoo-hoo! Pretty elephant! Like, I, I just, it's not possible for me to misplace an elephant. I, don't, I just don't think it's possible unless they, do they despawn after a period of time? If they don't, this, this should be a level three right here. Because he was way down the beach by us. Yeah, he's a male three. Okay, so where is she at? She's here somewhere. She's gotten herself. God, could she be way down here? I don't know if I could race back and, and not be hit by her. Well, this is good news. She's not down here. <clears throat> F14. Excuse me. Well, let me look around for her, see if I can find her, and then I'll bring you back. We may not have to worry about killing him at all. Looks like uh, we're going to be just fine without it. Uh, I'm going to have to eat a little something, too. Yoo-hoo, big, beautiful elephant. Where are you? Oh, could you be way up here? So I've not been able to find that elephant. I can't believe it. I've been on for like an hour, got the trap ready and stuff, and it just it's just disappeared. It's like it's not there anymore. I've not logged out of the game or anything. It's just it's just gone for some reason. I'm gonna keep I'm gonna keep looking to see. I mean, I guess that could be it right down there. Somehow it got itself down in here, but it was the last time I looked, which was just before I started recording, was right outside there, uh, just down the beach. We actually saw both of them. 
I guess I'm assuming that we saw both of them. But she was just back in this area right down in here, and I just cannot seem to track her down. Why the male three is still here and she's not, I don't know. I guess it's possible she could have gotten killed, but I'm not quite sure what would have done that to her. You don't usually see elephants laying on the ground dead. It's very rare that you see that. I mean, we could grab this three, but he's just, you know, he's just a three. She was a 34. She was going to be a, a nice, nice elephant to have. But yeah, she is just nowhere to be seen. I have no idea. So I'm just going to keep going down the beach here and see if... I don't know, maybe I can get a... We'll see how far away they are. Originally, I was going to build a trap way down here, but... Um, when I saw that opportunity, I thought, well, I'll grab this one. And now it's it seems to be gone. It's a nice looking horse. What level are you? Eight. And I'm out here alone, too, on foot. Not so smart. I have no backup. Yeah, the other elephants are way down there. Oh, man. That's disappointing. All right, I'll be back. I'm not sure the sun's getting ready to go down, too. Another beautiful day is underway. Um, I, f I feel the need to tame something. There's a horse over here. I've got a cage with me. I've been, I'm looking for a parrot. I've seen two so far, but they were kind of low level down by the elephant there. The elephant's just a level three, so I'm not too thrilled about that. But there's a horse up here. And I was wondering, can we cage a horse? Oh. Not if we do it that way. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. Well, we're not going to get that one. <laughs> They'll come back. Oh, man. So, I think you can. I think... Oh, they got it. Oh, what was the horse? Level 8, I think it said? Yeah, it's just an 8. All right. Yeah, I still have them set to uh, defend me. I'm hoping I could get... Try it out again. I want to get the cage over the top of it and see if I can do this. Maybe I should be in first person when I try this next time. The cage you can pick up, though, and it works really well for the parrots, too. I'm also looking for a, a way up. You guys, one of you said there was a, a passageway up through here. Ooh, that was all red. What was that? And what are you? Oh, I missed the number. We've got a few elephants down here, but it's an awful long ways to try to, you know, kite an elephant. That's for sure. I mean, that's just, it's ridiculous amount of distance i'd be better off building another trap down here or hoping that within the next couple of times i log in we've get another one that's you know available to us so you can deal with the parrots level 15 female parrot i'm gonna hold out for something a little bit bigger and you just go inside hit them with your pick bowl of them feed them a little bit and they're yours there's another horse right up here it's foggy of course it is. I'm recording. <whistles> oh, man. Do they ever stop moving? They don't seem to stop moving. It stopped for like a second. Maybe I can get it behind it when it stops for just that one second. It doesn't seem to know I'm here. I usually can run up on them really fast. Oh, oh we got it. Oh, look at that. 
Okay, and I brought I brought some sugar cane. We got the bola. All right. Number three. First person. Looks like it's headshots. It's level nine. We gotta bring its health down, of course. Okay, let's try number six now. Oh my gosh. Feeding you sugarcane, baby. We'll have a horse. That is... <laughs> that is amazing. Where's the feeding thing? That was weird. Taming speed is set on two. I had it on three for a little bit, maybe even four for a bit. It just was too easy. I still want the game to be a challenge. I'll set my coffee there real quick. Uh, are we gonna get her this this round, or are we gonna have to go one more? The 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 the, the marker is so far away. You know, it's like. <laughs> How much time you got left before the bowl that expires is right up there, in case you want to know. I don't know why it's way up there, but it is. Things that they'll change. Uh, let's just, let's just, I do that every time. Okay, well, what, what, what would you be called? Hmm. The horses are beautiful. All right, so we need a saddle. We're going to have to make a saddle, of course, to do that. Um, let's go, Jay. Everybody that's around this area that's with us can come to us. Oh, there's parrots galore out here right now, too. Tons of boars as well. I should probably kill all these animals off with our crew. Back off, level 6 ant. Uh, and I've put a few more panels on the ship as well. It's so foggy. I really should. Well, you're eating. You're, you're. I'm gonna just give you the rest of that. Well, actually, I think you like berries, don't you? What does it say for the horse here, real quick? Let me take a look. I've got my list right here next to me. They've got their preferred taming food, and then they've got their preferred food. So the horse is preferred taming food is sugarcane. Its preferred food is vegetables. So we will find it some vegetables, and uh, get those put in there for sure. Uh, why don't we take it back and we'll put a saddle on her and we'll take her for oh here's another horse What if this one's even better then? I'm gonna hit you to make them all stop walking Oh, no, I lost my chance <laughs> I screwed that up so bad Okay, it saw me. What was it? It's a level two. Let's not even let's not even worry about that right now. Okay, we know that works, so we could get another one. Uh, I try when I'm going to go out and tame. I try to keep a cage on me so I can do that. We'll we'll take we'll take the horse back. I'll let you guys come up with a name, uh, and then we'll uh, we'll take her out for a ride. Let's see what we can find. We really should kill everything off. <laughs> the horse was really... Oh, I'm so sorry I shot you with that arrow. Oh my goodness. Horrible, horrible, horrible owner. Yeah, I want to kill off some of these animals so we get some different ones to spawn in. There's a treasure map. Grab it. Common treasure map. <laughs> the horse is so dramatic about the killing. <laughs> 
she really just gets to running. She's like, oh. <laughs> there we go. Melee damage. I'm sure you get a level, don't you? Uh, no. I'll, I'll, I'll be looking for a higher level horse. Uh, for sure, but I thought we'd give that a try. It's fun to have them. One of you asked me to tame one last season, and we just didn't get to get the opportunity. Season one, I tamed them because they would just get stuck and stuff, and you could you could tame them. But um, yeah, that cage, it's pretty big cage. What are you? You're a four. I think this one out here was a higher level. I think it was like an 18 or something. Let's take a look at... Oh. He's got to come back eventually, right? Oh, there he comes. It's a level 9 male. Okay, they're really pretty, but they're the same exact... Almost the same exact colors is what they look like to me. Must be, you know, a couple. Oh, here's another one. He's got the same colors to him as well. Pretty bird is right. I tell you, you are a pretty bird. Their preferred taming food is hard tank. You need wheat, and I think it's salt. Probably some water as well. I have learned the uh, the bench, the uh, the grill. It's a seven. Yeah, they're all low level down here. I don't want a low level one. I'd rather hold out for a higher level one. I've even considered taking that that uh, that bull elephant down there, but. It's just a three, but still, you know, is, is this is where I this is where I ask myself, okay, is a three worth it? Is a three worth knock it down, have a, put a saddle on it, and it's it's gonna help somewhat, right? I mean, it's gonna help somewhat. It's, any help's better than no help at all. So that's kind of what I, I that's kind of how I feel about it. I think I should actually cart, cart it down. Um, what are you exactly? You are a tier two, so we need a tier two saddle. So we're gonna go over here. Saddles, tier two, we need hide and organic paste. 50 hide and organic. We're just going to grab a stack of hide out of here. And let's grab half of that organic paste. And there's a, let's grab a couple stacks of hide. There we go, beautiful. And we're going to throw this map in here so it's not on us. Um, I don't believe I need this anymore. We don't need any of that stuff anymore because, well, <laughs> we just killed it. Uh, I, I, I need to decide about this elephant. And then if a better one comes along, we tame it. We've got the pen out there, we, you know, we tame it. I would really like to gather up all the salt that's here for a day or two and get the salt kind of loaded up into a chest so we have it and just, you know, take advantage of the fact that we have some of this stuff here. go oh yeah that's much better look at that look at that how's how's her stamina you're hot can I shoot from her back I can can I turn well I could turn too while I'm riding on the back of the horse I did not know this I could shoot and turn. Be very easy. See, see, how, see how he gets close and look at this, the rays. He he works. He's worked his way all the way back down here now. From he was back here a little bit ago. Uh, we'll take a look at him next time we come by and see where he is. I may take him. Like I said, a level three, it's better than nothing. He's gonna. He maybe not be able to carry you know two three thousand pounds worth of wood or whatever, but. You know, even if he can carry a stack or two, it'd be great to have. Well, she's got some stamina, man. She can run. The horses are fun because they they just look so great. This is not what I would call my, my favorite colored horse. I want to go down here and see. There's always elephants down here, right? There are always elephants down here. Last time we came through here, there was a ray. And I say it all the time, if you don't know, if you get off the mount, they their stamina goes up much faster. Oh, we need to get her some vegetables, too. I 
We need to get the cooking pot going. All kinds of stuff. Uh, it really bums me out about the... Oh, what's this over here? Could this be her? Oh, this could be her. I'm not sure if that's her or not. Let's see. Who are you? No, you're not the right one. Yeah, that's not her. No, she was a 34 and she was more of a tan color than that. That one's gray. Oh, I got another level. I've been leveling like crazy just doing some grind work. It's been really enjoyable. Uh, there's something coming at us. Oh, it's a male scorpion over there. Okay, so let's go back to our inventory. Uh, I've been doing stamina so we can do some climbing. And then I've also unlocked uh, the higher hand harvesting so that we get more when we're harvesting stuff with our tools. Uh, improved oxygen reduction. Oh. See ya, Scorpion. Nice try, buddy. I saw ya. Uh, and then I learned uh, I'm working on the diving stuff as well. So we uh, less effect of the water temperature. 13. You're pretty small too, buddy. Where are the big elephants at? A two. Hmm. Ah, oh, man. I Now I feel like I just got lucky. That, that's how it is, though, for me. That's how all the tames are for me. It's just kind of opportune. Uh, not maybe the birds and the monkeys and things like that, but uh, these bigger creatures, most definitely. Ten. Nine. They're all really kind of small. I thought this guy was bloody. I don't like the way he looks. He's got the red all over him. One. These are all small. Oh, look at this. Look at these ants coming for my coming for the horse. Yeehaw! Get out of here! Ha ha ha! Not gonna happen today, ants. Not today. He's got a nice little back kick on it. The horse. But I don't think it's great. These parrots, man, they come down to the ground, they make you think they're going to land, and then they don't. They just kind of tap it and take off again. <laughs> oh, it's just not my day to tame. We got lucky with the old horse here, but uh, it's just, just not my day for taming it. Uh, the nice thing is I believe we could put the cart on her and use her to help us get... Uh... Oh, there's a crocodile right there. What is he doing? That's not a very good way to go. <laughs> That's a good way to get eaten. I'm on a horse. So you want to kind of avoid danger. I saw a tiger. It was white. It's the first one I've seen that wasn't already dead. I kind of back in a little cave area, you guys. I think one of you told me about it. Uh, just an area that was kind of tucked in and we didn't seen it before. There's many ways to get through uh, the island with these passageways like this. Matter of fact, is this where I saw the tiger? No, that's not where I saw the tiger. Yeah, this is where we saw Mr. Tortugar, huh? Right over here. Well, he's not there today. <laughs> he's not there today. All right, I'll be back. Time for the crocodiles, the alligators to spawn in, it looks like. I've decided to give this a try. I'm going to go ahead and grab this level 3 male. There it is. Should fit in here. There it is. There we go. Beautiful. Um. 
I'm really curious as to what happened to that big one I had. This is why we need two bows. <laughs> Plenty of arrows. Some people like to use the crossbow, I think, but I think it, it causes too much damage and it's harder to control, where it's just better to have a couple of bows and do it this way. And I've got potatoes on my hot bar. Oh, ouch. <laughs> Don't do that. We were in the right spot, though. Just to be a little more careful, that's all. Go, it's a potato. Oh, God, the squatter. Squatter's throwing poop. <laughs> okay, let's get back to what we're doing. I always forget he's on my shoulder. It's so easy to forget you've got a, an animal sitting on your shoulder. Maybe we'll get one more potato in it. I think. Maybe they've made this a little bit different. Did they adjust the taming? It doesn't seem quite... They don't seem quite as sensitive. They're also not banging. He's he's not banging on the corner posts here, which is usually pretty normal for them. I mean, to attack me because I got in too close and I probably bumped him, that's one thing, but... He's not doing that spaz thing where they just keep, you know, swinging their head and banging on stuff. We're going to have to get out of here. Here we go. One more. Shoot him into buttocks. Keep him right down here where he's at. It seems to be a good place for him. Okay. Still too much. There we go. Fantastic. Sometimes they will shift a little bit after they land, so you got to be careful about that. Well, this would be great if I could get right up in here. I'm willing to bet this animal's probably on just about every M8 island here. Not to say it, it is for sure, but I'm, I'm willing to bet it is. Should have it in just a second here. Let's call him Buddy. Come on, buddy. <laughs> you are a tier 3 saddle because you are a big fella. So let's get you... Let's get you saddled up, buddy. Come on. We'll see what kind of help you're going to be to us. Oh, what kind of weight does, what does, does he have on him? Oh my gosh, 2,040? Pretty nice. I'm trying to remember what Velma had on her. That's that's a pretty nice amount of weight. And you're handsome too. All right, let's uh, let's see a, let's see about a saddle. I need to get some torches going and stuff. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to need is a tier two saddle, and I need more fiber. So do I have fiber in here? I realize it's dark. I'm sorry. I will try to get we'll try to get a little more torch action going next episode for you guys, so we can see better in here. It's been a very busy and odd week for me this week. Can I make it? I can. Now what do I need for this here? Metal and organic paste. I need 32 organic paste. I know I picked some up. Uh, it may be on... Yes, there we go. Oh. I'm not going to cook the prime. I'm not going to cook that either. Oh, I've only got four uh, cementing paste. We can make more. I uh, just, uh, it's been nice having the bugs. I'm a little spoiled with those bugs. They're kind of nice to have. So we're missing 
more than half the organic paste and 12 metal. Okay, so let's see if, what we got left in here for organic paste. I know we have some. Oh, there we go. Okay, and then some metal. Let's just grab that metal out of there right there. This is good. An elephant is a very good thing, I think, to have. Saddle, tier 3. And then I can make the cart as well, if I'm not mistaken. And we have a saddle on her, so she should be able to hold, handle the cart. I'm going to drop that meat, and we're going to put these berries down here. We need to get some vegetables for uh, both of them, for sure. Uh, yeah, I'm going to throw those potatoes in there. There you go, big guy. And then you've got a saddle as well. I just made it, so let's put that on you. There we go, beautiful. Uh-huh. Oh, that's right. Level up. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Stamina. Um, okay, so we were talking about this earlier. In piracy, I have gone diver down almost as far as, well, that's it right there. Advanced diver. Advanced shoveler as well, so I get better resources and more resources when I dig with my shovel in the ground. That's very helpful. The next one I want to do is, I'm going to spend a point on plunder. Matter of fact, I'm going to do this and this, just to get those in the middle. Health kits. I did do the imp improvised here. Advanced self healing. I'm going to do that right there. Beast mastery. You can see I got the cargo harness. I'm not going to learn the carriage, but I am going to get tier three sneaking. This and this. Yes, that's going to work right there for me there. And then food. Um, well, what about Captain Earring? Basics of crew, of course. Ship maintenance, of course. So basics of crew. Now we can make the uh, resource chest, right? Yeah, this is the resource chest and then the... Uh, um, what is it? The, the food thing. The food thing. The larder, the larder, the larder. Squatter, you can come back up now. Oh, he's got a level two. Everybody's leveling. Here we go. Okay, so we've got an elephant. Uh, he's healing very slowly. He's, I guess he's almost there. He could use some more food. Uh, and then how are you doing? You need food as well. I've got you on the turmeric. Your vegetables, and I believe... Uh, the elephant is also vegetables, right? Or is it... You know, I, what I do is I get a bunch, put it on them, and I don't ever even think about it again. Elephant is berries. Okay, so he likes the berries, which is... Thank you. I'm glad you like the berries. That's right, he is a berry guy. Do we have berries in here that we could just throw on him? There we go, beautiful. Look at that. You do your thing and heal up, Buster Brown. There we go. He's almost up. His health is really low. 325. Melee is 114. But his weight is just stupendous. Let's go take him out and see what kind of wood we can get with this guy. We've not gone too long without an elephant. It's nice to have one. I'm glad I decided to do this. When a bigger one comes along, we'll tame it. This is the opportunity that I had where I built the trap. Trap worked great. And they, he act, acted very differently in... Wouldn't you say? Acted extremely differently. It's nice. How does he do on the fruit trees? He gets a few grapes. Okay, so stamina is horrible. <laughs> What's his stamina? I didn't look. 330. Okay. I think stamina and health is where it's going to have to go into. But look at this. I've almost got three stacks of wood. Uh, and we've only been out here for just a few seconds. Which is amazingly cool. So I got back here and I'm thinking, what are you doing? Get that larder made. Get it placed. Get your food in it. And it's going to last you a whole lot longer. So we're going to put the larder right in here. Like so. And we should be able to transfer our food over. And that's going to be just... Just a huge save. Just a huge save. Let's see if we grab all this stuff. We can. All right, beautiful. We'll put the maps back in here. 
Uh, this will be our new chest to just kind of throw the odds and ends into here at the base. Our initial kind of little camp out spot. And then we're going to put all the food. What? Is it full? Oh, oh that's thatch. What am I doing? <laughs> Those are fronds. Oil, okay. None of that, of course. There we go. Alright, there's our food, and let's throw those potatoes in there. That's the food that we have. Uh, the oil I have in here, once we find some crystal, we can make our, our lights. So all the food's going to go in there. There's our ship wheel. I've got that made, so let's see how many of these things we can make now. Uh, actually, you know what? I still have a little more material on uh, Buddy here to get off to put into there. Let's go like that, 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 and that. Uh, a little encumbered, but I think I can do it. You're encumbered. You know, with the with the rainstorms coming up as fast as they do here, it makes me think, you know what? The seas in this area are probably going to be busy, if you know what I mean. They're just going to be busy. Storms are going to be frequent, because it, it does rain here a lot. I'm kind of surprised just how much it rains here. Week three. What am I missing? Fiber. Fiber. Story of my life. Fiber, wood, thatch. Fiber, wood, and thatch. Fiber, wood, and thatch. Uh, so, yeah, I need to go back out and get a whole bunch of fiber. I, I extended this a little bit, too, just to put the loom on and get things kind of organized out here a little bit more. Again, this will always be kind of a place we can come to if we die or something we need to spawn somewhere. We, we'll be able to come out here and, uh, you know, spawn here if we needed to. Number seven. Three, so I need another one, two, three. Three more on the bottom, and then uh, I can do the second row as well. Not too bad, though. It shouldn't be too bad. If I go out and just get fiber, uh, that'll be great. I'll just go do that and get a bunch of fiber. And I should have, hopefully, I would think all the walls on the ship done by the next episode. I would hope so. And then we're going to need a bunch of ceilings. Yeah, we're going to need a bunch of ceilings as well. But yeah, the fiber is where I'm coming up short, is it not? That's what it said. All right. So that's going to have to wrap up today's episode. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, do pick, uh, do hit that like button for me. Comment, subscribe, and share. I'm the Radio Man 3 I want you to have an awesome, a fantastic, and a superb day. And I do look forward to talking to you again next time.